Next to the race for the White House, GOP frontrunner Donald Trump making headlines once again, this time not because of something he said, but because of what he is not saying. Here's ABC's Mary Bruce. Tonight, the Trump campaign is silent after a terror group used the Republican frontrunner to recruit. Donald J. Trump is calling for a total and complete shutdown. A new video from the militant group Al-Shabaab, Al-Qaeda's affiliate in Somalia, shows Trump at a campaign rally calling to ban Muslims entering the U.S. Trump tonight is not responding, but he is defending his controversial proposal and slamming the Democratic frontrunner. Tweeting, Hillary Clinton said that it is okay to ban Muslims from Israel by building a wall, but not okay to do so in the U.S. We must be vigilant. He is becoming ISIS's best recruiter. Clinton sparked a bitter feud with Trump when she said his language was providing fodder for terrorists. They are going to people showing videos of Donald Trump insulting Islam and Muslims in order to recruit more radical jihadists. A claim that was never proven. Trump blasted Clinton, demanding an apology. It turned out to be a lie. She's a liar. This is not ISIS, and this video did not exist when Hillary Clinton said that it did. But this does validate the spirit of her argument. Trump also continues to go after both Clintons for playing what he calls the woman's card, tweeting today that the former president is a hypocrite. Meanwhile, Trump supporters are making themselves heard, interrupting a Bernie Sanders rally today in Massachusetts. And his detractors taking to the skies over the Rose Bowl, writing in an aerial message, Trump is disgusting. And after weeks of mudslinging, Donald Trump and Bill Clinton will face off on Monday, holding dueling events just miles apart. Cecilia.